Bloomberg's play has failed. It has been a good night for Joe Biden. This is the new reality facing Bernie Sanders and his campaign. Unlike the president, I didn't come here to golf. It's like he spent the night in the casino and spent a ton of money on blackjack, spent a ton of money on roulette, uh, failed with every single one on the way out. He got a couple of quarters out of the slot machines from American Samoa and somebody saying they would validate his parking. It's been a terrible night for Bloomberg. His strategy has failed. It's hard to see a viable course from here, despite him saying he will battle on. It's a good night! It's been a very good start to Super Tuesday for Joe Biden. Now, he did say it is early days, and he joked about the fact that there are still two little states that we haven't heard from yet, referring, of course, to Texas and to California. The polls just closing in California, still postal votes, all sorts of votes to count. So really a sense of the unity of the moderates that have gathered behind Joe Biden. Now, his campaign has taken on a whole new lease of life. not been a good night for Bernie Sanders. It really hasn't. We are going to defeat Trump. The Sanders camp knew that at some point they would be up against one candidate who would represent the moderate vote of the Democratic Party. They knew that the others would coalesce around him. It was probably going to be Joe Biden. But what they weren't expecting is that it would happen so quickly and happen tonight on Super Tuesday. So this is the new reality facing Bernie Sanders and his campaign. Joe Biden is now the man they must beat to get to the White House. And that's looking increasingly difficult.